by 8 o'clock. I was still in my nothings in bed, and I heard something from the porch. A weird sound from the dog I hadn't heard before. I uh, went to the front door, looked out the window, and I saw something on top of it, under, under the bush, right next to the porch. I immediately, I, something's happened to the dog, I open the door, I, I jump out in my jeez, and wave <laughs> my hands, and uh, yell. The kids think something's really wrong with Dad. And, and so I, and I run in the house, you know, so they don't see me. That, that way I get dressed. The dog runs off to the neighbor's. If you know where I live, at Weston Canyon, we're facing north, there's a dirt road. At the, on the west end of the dirt road is John and Jordan Gunnell. On the east side, there's my parents, Kevin and Linda Olson. The dog runs to the Gunnels, which is a half mile away. Um, the cat walks off to my parents' house through their yard. Uh, <clears throat> my neighbor, uh, John and Jordan Gunnell, they call and say, Hey, your dog's down here bleeding all over the, the porch and spurting blood on our windows. Do you want to come and get it? <laughs> 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 Yeah, I just got attacked by a mountain lion, and then my dad calls and says, hey, there's this cool mountain lion walking through the yard. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I just attacked the dog. And then my dad um, used some other words and, and started calling the fishing game, and uh, we, I posted something on Facebook, and, and then a few, uh, a few days later, Fox News, CNN, and BBC. <laughs> and then yesterday, Ripley's Believe It or Not, the vice president gives me an email saying that we want to buy it. Uh, I don't have it. So unnamed friends do. <laughs> I don't know what it's worth, but maybe something. So it, the cat, if you don't know, it, it had this weird growth out the side of its head with, uh, with some teeth in it, and it just looks really strange. So the hunters, they came later in the day, uh, about 11, they tracked it to the top of the cliffs there in Western Canyon, and they brought it down about 4, down to the house. I looked at it, took some pictures, um, touched the little thing on its head, <laughs> and uh, said goodbye. <laughs> Story, I'm sticking to it. Uh, if a citizen wants more, they can get it from me. Nobody else is, I'm not going to talk to anybody else about it. <laughs> um, we do look forward to this next year.